Hello, welcome to Pro Mixing and Mastering. Um, today I'm doing a, a tutorial video for one of our subscribers whose name is uh, Hope Kandulu, and uh, he asked uh, this question, Sir, there is, is there any other way in Cubase 5 to automate effects? I mean, like when the artist is singing and the delay must stop and then open when uh, the artist starts singing again. So, uh, Hope Kandulu, um, yes, there is a way in Cubase 5 and I I'm gonna show you. In fact, there are many ways you can do automation uh, using effects and also just uh, using the ordinary way. So, in case you want some automation, this is how you do it in QPS 5. So, I've got my um, my vocal here for my artist. As an example, I'm just going to add, highlight and then I'm going to press P on my, key, uh, on my keyboard. Just make sure that it rotates. Then I'm going to come to transport cycle and I'm going to put it on. And um, this is how it sounds like with uh, with uh, um, delay turned on without automation. So as you as you can uh, listen to the way the vocal is going, the the uh, delay just keeps going and going and going. There is no on and off. So automation is simply to uh, automate the process, the vocal processing. That is automation to automate uh, the process during uh, vocal mixing, and as simple as that. So to make sure that we stop the automation. Uh, the the uh, delay from continuing we are going to do something that is called writing writing in uh in qbs5 so what is writing i want you to uh look at um uh here is my delay right here the one that i've soloed here's my delay so i just can i just um you, all you have to do is right click and then come to show automation if you want you can hide automation I don't want to hide the automation since I'm working on automation I have showed my automation and this is uh, this line right here is my automation as you can see if I bring down the volume the automation goes down and then if I take it up so this line uh, this line right here is my automation that I'm gonna be working on and this is a uh, the simple way of doing it in Cubase 5. So all you've got to do is uh, click on W, this W, write, enable, write automation. So I've enabled it. This is why it shows red, this side, and the R is uh, green. So my writing, I'm going to write, I'm not gonna do it uh, more like manually. This is gonna be like an automatic thing. It's gonna be easy then from there. I will be able to to um, to do away with what I don't want and put in what I want. So after you have enabled write um, in Cubase, all you have to do now is, uh, as you can see, I've really taken my volume to to the last to the last 6.02. The reason is because I want the automation to be um, to be easier and also to be smooth uh, this is what I mean so I'm gonna be bringing the volume I'm gonna be taking the volume out whenever the singer stops singing and this side Cubase will be writing for me what I'll be doing here on the volume uh, on the volume whenever I want the uh, delay to be engaged I'm gonna take uh, the volume I'm gonna increase the volume to the maximum and whenever the, I want the, the 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 delay are not to be engaged I'm gonna take it to zero so I'm gonna keep doing the process and just keep doing it keep doing if I want uh, let's say you want the delay to 
come in about 50 you can just take it on 50 and the uh, automation will pick that up and write according to the way you are flowing so this is how I'm gonna do it let me just um, uh, maximize my vocal by pressing H and then to to zoom out just press G to zoom to zoom in just press H so I've zoomed in as you can see there are these empty places right here where the vocal where the singer is not singing and we have this then we have this then we have this and then we have this so I'm gonna be turning off the delay right there so uh, here we go uh, the, f the, 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 the first thing that you have to do is let the vocal play play as you do the automation so right now the automation is engaged and then the volume is maximized to 6.02 db and here we go watch what is going to be happening now while it's in the pool while it's in the pool while it's in the pool Puffing to fuels. Now you might say, number in color. A bona fide up my nose. Show for boo. Artillery. All right, simple way of doing automation. As, as you can see, I was just turning on and off vo the volume on and off. Whenever the singer stops singing, I bring it down. Whenever the singer uh, is singing, I put it back. So listen to it now with the aut uh, automation. While it's in the pool, Baba Manu. While it's in the pool. So as you can see right there, the automation, uh, the, 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 the delay stops and then continues. Uh, like now, the delay continues right there. And mixed together with the reverb, it sounds good like this. So w w once you do the automation and then you put in the reverb, it 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 works properly like that not just the delay alone with the reverb a little bit or reverb it depends on the song that you're doing so let's say you don't want it to just cut just like that you can come on um on line right here on top on line and then uh select just left click and uh click on line let's say you wanna you want it to add and smoothly all you have to do is on the line just come here and uh, line it up like this so it's gonna be like a little bit of a uh, fed in effect like this as you can see it's not just it, it, it is not as you can listen to it it's not just um, ending right there it it has this fed uh, fed out effect and then if you want to uh if you also want you can also do um a fed in effect so that it um fades out and in fades out and in instead of uh just stopping like this uh, what? so you can bring it so that so that it can have that fade in fade out effect so basically uh this is the way you you do your automation in cubase 5 if you want uh, the delay to be coming in and off in and off then let's say you just want it to be um let me undo this my automation yeah let's say you wanna um uh have it only at the end and then just the ending parts just the ending parts all the same just take back the volume and like this so as you can see we are going now to get our line and then just um uh make it make it smooth 
just like that just at the end and then um from there we can also just just um do this and the rest of of the the rest can just be uh zeroed out if you want just to have it at the end and basically this is the way you do automation i hope this video helped you and uh, remember there are many ways to do automation there are so many many thousand ways but this is one of my simplest ways that i do automation automation you can do this to vocals you can do this to reverbs you can do this to uh choruses you can do this to uh uh cla effects it's all dependent on what uh, you wanna achieve uh, concerning your vocal mixing and production so um, you can also do this when it comes to mixing uh, mastering I mean I hope this video helped you please don't forget to subscribe to my channel share the video uh, give me a like and I will see you in the next video